why aren't classical statues well endowed? I mean, you've noticed that old statues are kind of... I mean, they don't really have... Okay, I'll just say it, they have small penises. Well, you have to consider the body standards at the time. In Aristophanes' The Clouds, one character describes the ideal male form as having a good chest, a clear complexion, broad shoulders, a moderate tongue, sturdy buttocks, and a small, genteel penis. Some of these body standards ring true today. I mean, I love a guy with a moderate tongue. According to art history blogger Ellen Ordson, Cultural values about male beauty were completely different back then. Today, big penises are seen as valuable and manly, but back then, most evidence points to the fact that small penises were considered better than big ones. Ultimately, it's not size that matters, it's era. 